Start anywhere you like. Take your time, 007, but in five minutes, the head of the Joint Security Service is going to walk through that door, and I've got to explain to him how one of our agents decided to potter off to Mexico all on his own and cause an international incident. With all due respect, sir, it could have been worse. Worse? You blew up half a bloody block. Well, better half a block than a whole stadium full of people. You had no authority. None. As you know, we're in the middle of the biggest shake-up in the history of British intelligence. The ink's barely dry on this merger with MI5, and already they're itching for a chance to scrap the double-O program forever, and you've just given them one. You're right, sir. You have got a tricky day ahead. This is an official question. Mexico City, what were you doing there? It's just a coincidence. I was taking some overdue holiday. OK, fine. As of this morning, you are officially grounded. I'm standing you down from all operations indefinitely. Very good, sir. 007? Sir? I don't know what you're playing at, but whatever it is, it has to stop. Now. So sorry, am I interrupting? Not remotely, 007. I'd like you to meet Max Denby, head of the Joint Security Service. Well, it's a pleasure to finally meet you, 007. I've heard a lot about you. Most of it good. Congratulations on your new appointment. Thank you. I suppose we should call you C now. No, no. Max, please. No, I think I'll call you C. C. As you wish. Well, my door is always open, 007, for my employees. This merger is going to be a whole new chapter for us. We're going to bring British intelligence out of the dark ages into the light. That all sounds lovely. That'll be all, 007. Report to Q tomorrow for medical. Thank you. Very good, sir. <laughs> 